What's going on guys, your boy Statitio Sis coming back with another video. In today's video I'm going to be talking about the Fortnite Champion Series and how other pro players were cheating in this. If you guys don't know, uh, there was another claim of cheating with the top two duos in the NA East banned over allegations of team uh, teaming during the finals. Now Nate Kriyoku, Logan, Bucky, Eskenberg, and... Keys and Slacks were all suspended by Epic Games over reports of the four players concluded during the finals of week one during the FNCS duos tournament on March 22nd. Now claims started circulating after the duos both dominated the field to take home the two top spots in week one. Uh, Twitter user Grow Oxide highlighted the two du duos uh, allegedly concluding when tagging each other to save themselves from Storm Surge. Now, if you don't take damage to other players during Storm Surge, you will be eliminated. So you got to do damage to other players or you start taking health like crazy. Now, the pairs have been doing so, uh, so, doing so during the FNCS warm-up last week and the official games... Uh, this week, furthering feeling suspicions that it was not innocent once off. Now, Fortnite, aka Epic Games, obviously the creator of Fortnite, uh, were inclined to agree that the four players were teaming, which is a bannable offense in the FNCS. The two duos were banned for 60 days, making them ineligible for the rest of the FNCS Chapter 2 Season 2 duos, as well as a possible, as, as well as possibly the next season of this. Now, under Section 8. Point two point two of the Fortnite uh, CS Chapter 2 Season 2 official rules. Players may not work together to deceive or otherwise cheat other players during any match, including working together during the match while on, po uh, on opposing teams. Now, <clears throat> you guys don't remember that Fortnite did do a couple updates uh, in the recent weeks, and one of the updates was if you were caught... Swinging your pickaxe, you were jumping, you were acting any way, uh, looking like you were teaming with another team. It is basically a bannable offense, and you can get banned for days, or you can be officially banned from Fortnite. Now, the four players have issued their statements defending themselves publicly. The duos claim that they often scrim together and know each other's past very well, and this is why they have constantly engaged in the same area. And now it says, wish we were at least had the opportunity to explain ourselves without everyone hopping on the bandwagon, said Creo after the news of the ban became public. Also, wish for and I did some sort of investigation and asked us questions. Now, let me ask, let me ask you guys that real quick. I'm going to ask you guys a question. So, let's say you were teaming with another player and you get caught and you get caught red-handed now this has been happening not once not twice this happened six games and this is ridiculous because they all ended up in the same spot they all ended up in slurpy slurpy swamp and they all ended up in the same areas each fucking time they were tagging they were cheating caught red-handed now a lot of people are defending them saying hey man let them you know investigate well investigate no matter what they do if they do investigate it you are still getting caught it's the same two duos uh we have this where other players were dropping in if you guys don't remember in uh the previous thing when it happened with people not shooting at other players so I'm just, I'm just getting back into this. So it says, we know where people land due to maps that are made by third parties, adding Bucky. Our loot route directs us to that one truck with the one chest added. By the time they are done with their loot route, they end up at the slurp truck, and we end up shooting at each other since we crossed paths. <clears throat> now, MV Bunky said Storm Surge on Twitter. The ban has divided the Fortnite community with some players saying the suspension is deserved while other players come out defending the duos claiming that Epic made the call to ban them too early. I don't feel like Epic should should have acted like this the way said Cody Clicks Conrad. I feel like they didn't have a chance to, de to even defend themselves. This 60 ban the 60 day ban uh, is life changing for all of them. None of them are, are gonna be signed again. 
and they're missing a whole FM CS. And now we have clicks on Twitter saying, I don't feel like Epic should have acted fast. I feel like they didn't have a chance to do it, even to defend themselves. Okay, I just basically just said that. <clears throat> so, we also had Bizzle, Ghost Bizzle, saying, People are hating on me. I'm not the one who cheated. The video was already on Twitter before I reposted it. And nothing with Creo Bucky. He's lax in the past, but they cheated. Got caught. They're both good duos and could have done fine without concluding for Storm Search. Now, Tim Bizzle Miller disagreed, saying that Fortnite did the right thing for the other players to take the duos down. Two month ban, surprisingly good by Epic, he stated. And nothing wrong with the other players in the past, but they cheated and got caught. Epic has still not made a statement about this, but I want you guys' uh, viewpoint on this. Should uh, pro players be banned automatically, or should they get some time to uh, get investigated and looked into the process? Now, anything on Twitter you could possibly see, but as well, the Fortnite community is always watching, and they're always watching to see who's doing dirty. Now, just because you're a pro player doesn't mean you can get away with things. There is uh, consequences to things that you are doing, and if you think it's good or not, I don't care. Uh, does it really bother me? But if you think that cheating is a way of, you know, winning, that has never been uh, the right way to win a game or anything. As well, let you guys know on this last point, that these two duels that ended up uh, winning week one, they ended up being the top one and two placements. Uh, so that's kind of weird because they're both East and a East. And also, well, obviously, they're going to be in NA East, obviously, because they'll be facing off in the same, uh, you know what I mean? <clears throat> but, like I'm saying, just to be watching people carefully is a good thing. And then shout out to all the people that were watching these duos. Now, if they were live, then there's a possibility that can get caught. But let's see what Epic says. Uh, like I said, there's a two-month ban against them, uh, which I think is fair. Uh, anything that is cheating, they should have known this. Uh, it doesn't matter what you're doing. It doesn't matter if you guys are practicing in the same area. It doesn't matter if it's because of third parties. It doesn't matter about any of that. It matters because Epic legit made a update like three, two weeks ago saying if you were swinging pickaxes, if you're jumping, if you're acting any sort of way, there is going to be a ban, and according to their official rules on any of the championships that are happening right now, you're going to get banned, and they're going to look closely, and they got time to act, they're a gaming company, yeah, you may have time to defend yourself, but if you were cheating in a game, you're going to get banned, that's the same thing in Grand Theft Auto, if you're over here doing money glitches, you're going to get banned, if you're over here, uh, doing certain things in games you're not supposed to you're gonna get banned but like i said let me know in the comments down below guys what you guys think about this it's your boy static hope you guys have a great day peace out late